All right, so there's an exciting new update in Google Forms, and honestly, really, it's in Google Sheets, but it does affect Google Forms moving forward. And that's these really cool feature where there's table templates baked into Google Sheets. So the way this is set up is that anytime you go into a Google Form and you have people fill out a survey, you know, you can always have that data go over into a Google Sheet. So you can do more sorting, analyses, formulas, all that good stuff. Well, now in Google Sheets, it organizes anything from a Google Form into a table. So this only applies to Google Forms and Sheets from about mid-September forward. And everyone in BCSE should see this now. But if you have, if you really like this feature, you can actually apply it retroactively to your other forms. You just have to go into your format settings. So to show you this, I'm going to show you an example. So I have a Google Form here, a couple of responses. To get to this, I'm going to click Responses and then View in Sheets. I already have created the sheet, but if I have it, I'm going to click it here and it's going to prompt me to create a new Google Sheet so I can see my stuff. And when I do, it populates it this way. So if you notice, this is very different than what it used to look like before, just your standard, you know, Google Sheets look. And now I have a nice little table here. If I want to change colors, I can. I can adjust things if I need to. If I don't like this table, you can totally get rid of this table. All right. You can revert it to unformatted data back to what it used to look like. But this is nice because honestly, you have these drop downs here, which make it a lot easier for you to just filter fewer clicks, makes it look a little bit more clean. So that is how you can access this in Google Forms and Sheets. So this applies to all Google Forms moving forward. If you want to use this for a Google Sheet, and maybe it's not connected to a Google Form, you can do that too. I'll just go into Format, and then you convert any of your, da any of your data into a table, which is Control-Alt-T, and that's for any type of data you have aside from that being in a Google Form. So thought I would share this. This affects everyone moving forward and is a nice little hack for making your data look a little bit more visually appealing and also easy to manipulate.